this cable. Aha! My mama didn't raise no fool. See? Easy peasy. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. No! Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone! Welcome back everybody to another episode of Stray. Just right off the bat I want to say thank you for the support. The second episode actually did a lot better than the first episode. And weirdly enough I didn't think Stray was going to be the game to get the most engagement from. But be it as it may guys, thank you very much. It really does mean a lot knowing that the support is there to see more. And as promised, we'll have more. We're heading to that building past these guys there. Now I want to just make sure I've got the route sorted out because there's rats everywhere. And I don't know how to get past them otherwise. Well zip zip them. Watch watch. Take this. Take this. Oh, 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 oh. Okay no not like that. Not like that. Not like that. Okay. <laughs> Suckers. Okay, I know I'm tuning them, but you know, it's it keeps me it keeps me motivated <laughs> knowing that I can just run past them and yeah. There's more people. Come, let's go up here. Where are you going? What do you want? What do you want, huh? Come this way. Come get me! Ew. Oh, they can! They can actually get me! Oh my goodness! Oh, this is not going... You learn something new every day. These rats. Whew. Okay. So, I, I've realized the paths are pretty linear. They're pretty linear. It says, oh, remember. Go B12. The city is full of neon. It wasn't always this way. It used to be a strict energy caps, especially in the slums. But people couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day someone lit up rainbow lamps, neon signs all over their house. That person was taken away and never seen again. But people saw hope, and not long after, everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes. There was nothing the oppressors could do. It was a way for people to see colors again, like on the outside, I think it helped. Okay. Oh, and a funny fact, well, something that I that I realized is the little robot's name is B12, which is also the logo of the developer. It's uh, Blue 12, which is kind of cool. I just noticed it. Probably not very interesting, but you know, just. Something I noticed. Where are we going? I think I'm going back, yeah? Here we go. Now. Okay, so in the first episode, we learned how to use drums. They won't be catching me again like that. Okay, we'll go there. And there. No, no. Stay there. We'll go up here. We'll go up here. we we'll go there. Here we go. Up here, and now let's have a look. Okay, so that's the tower we're going to, right? So we're going this way. I don't like this black. Look at this. This is absolutely disgusting. Oh crap! Oh crap! Okay, so I'm gonna hack the door, right? And then I'm gonna jump up there and across. Morons. Okay, 
Okay. This place is disgusting. Look at this. Here we go. We're coming, tower. That's the tower we need to get to. I think we might... Oh, look at all those rats. Oh my goodness, look at all the rats. Is that rats? No, it's not. Eggs, maybe. Okay, that's just disgusting, actually. Can I hack this? I don't like this place. Get the bolt. Jump 500 times. Nice. Okay. Now we know. Oh my gosh. This is the place they want me to be. I don't know if there's any rats. Or what are they called? I forgot what they're called. I'm just calling them rats. There's rats over there. And over there. So where do they want me to go, I wonder? Probably straight across there. Can I sneak by? Ah! Uh, it's not chasing me! Get off me! Whew. I think I'm at the right place now. There's more rats over there. Are they trapped? I wonder. Oh, I've, I need to get in there. Which means I'm gonna attract them there, hack that side, run around. Jump up here. And close the door again. Okay. Let's see if I can do this successfully without any issues. Oh, run, run. Jump off. Hack the door, hack the door. There we go. Right now, I need to get that. What the hell? Did they die? Why are they dying? I think this is where we're going. Yeah, they're dying. Look at that. Nice. No, that's not where we're going. No, I wonder. There's a bar up there. No, man. There's one left. Okay, so... I need to open the door. I think I need to get this closer, okay. No, man. Here we go. Figured it out. Oh no. Oh no. Come. Run. Run, 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 run as fast as you can. I don't know what happened. I'm 
not hating it. This area gets more and more freaky, dude. Like, seriously. Let me guess, I'm going down. No, I'm not. At least. Where does it want me to go, I wonder? I can only see us going this way, but now... What's this cable? Aha! My mom didn't raise no fool! See? Easy peasy. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. No! Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. Now I have to run around while these things are chasing me until the elevator comes. Ah! Elevators here, elevators here, elevators here. How do I get in? I can just wait for them to. Oh, there's a lot. They just keep coming. Ah. Good. Okay. Good. <laughs> These things are horrifying. Like, legit horrifying. Alright, we're going up. We made it to the top. Look at that. Of course it doesn't open. Why would it? Okay. Here it is. Put the transceiver on this antenna. Which antenna? Okay, which antenna? That one. I need to get to the top first. Oh no, I'm not going down there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Look, the view, it's beautiful from here. Well, not really. I remember now, the city, it was meant to be a shelter. Those look like stars, but they're only lights marking the hermetic roof ceiling of the city. Hermetic roof of... Okay, my reading's off today, sorry guys. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came to a cost. Nobody can go out. The outside was a disaster, completely barren, unlivable and dangerous. And if you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. And my promise wasn't just to go to the outside, it was the city. Still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back to find Momo. 
Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. Is this a shortcut back to Momo? Please tell me it is. But I'm not doing all of this again. Right? Yeah, now I'm going straight to Momo, it looks like. Okay, Momo! Momo? Look, a note! Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to open it is quite simple. It's... Oh, okay, that's simple enough. Be careful. <laughs> it is case sensitive. See you at the bar, <laughs> Momo. <laughs> that must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Here's a lock for the window. The code was. Hmm. It was an H, I think. Oops, my bad. Okay, let's try it again. And then it was an O or was it a zero? Let's see. It worked. Mom is at the bar waiting for us. Okay, I like that little a little detail. That's cool. Okay, where's the bar? Do we know where the bar is? I don't think we do, do we? Oh, there is the bar. It says bar, so it must be the bar. Momo! Hey, little fool. Come here. I managed to get a signal. Okay, I'm just gonna stand here. Eh, yeah, thank you. Let me see if I can get this thing working. Dot 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 dot. I've almost got it. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Hello? Yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Zalzalzabar? Momo? I, I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice. So, Z? I'm gonna call him Z. That name is... Zabaltazar. Zabaltazar. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes. Shh. We are safe. Shh. We found a way up. Shh. Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Shh. Very dangerous. Shh. Zerks everywhere. To us? Hello? How? Darn it. We've lost the signal. I can't believe it. The Baltazar is alive. He and the other outsiders managed to go to the go up through the sewers. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums, but if the balls are made it, there must be a way. Dot dot dot. Ah. Seamus says, you'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with zerks. They'll make a quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past. It doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. C 
Maximus. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. Don't listen to Seamus. He's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned the secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There must be a clue in Seamus' apartment. Come on, follow me. We're following the leader. I like the way he's walking. Such a relaxed style. Okay. The details quite nice. I mean, it's a very linear game, but it's it's nice. It's a lot of details here. Translate. I'm looking for sheet music to elevate it. Okay. Come on, Seamus, open the door. You know your father would have wanted us to help us. Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about outsiders anymore. He won't help me, but you... Hang on, hang on, hang on. They're robots, right? So how can Doc have a son? How does that... It doesn't compute for me. I think I have an idea. Like, that just occurred to me now. Can robots reproduce? Okay. Yeah, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. Okay. Contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab that outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try and re-establish communication with others. Yeah, sure you are. <laughs> Anything in here? With hey Seamus. Uh, I'm gonna show you this. Wait, what is this? Is this my papa's? Oh wow, I never knew! There's a secret room here in our flat? But where? It's a secret, Seamus. Maybe it's in this door. No. <laughs> okay, let's have a look. Let's have a look see around. It's not a very big flat, so it has to be here somewhere, right? What's this? I found this. I need a code. Do you have a code? I've never noticed a digipad before. How could I miss it? I've no idea what a passcode could be. Maybe it's in the notebook. Oh, hang on. Two. See the clock stay behind him? It's two. Oh, what's well, that? A five? Let's have a look. Two, five, one, one. Two, five, one, one. Let's give it a go. Two, one, two, five, one, one. <laughs> I'm the prettiest kitty alive. Ooh. Very gloomy. I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints, they must be for his Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive about his work. He told me the weapon He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. 
He went outside the slums and he never came back. Okay, let's build it, dude. Translate this. Robot headlights are officially no longer under control and now eat metal. What? Find anything interesting in here? Oh, you want me to find something, okay. Nothing in there. I'm not looking, dude. Um, I'm looking. Anything up here? Yeah. What about up here? Translate. Good size, but never friendly. All bacteria of human time. Eat all kind of materials. Total vision in the dark. React to intense light. Ooh, okay. Anything in here? Ah! Okay, let's go. I did find something. Whatever this is, broken tracker. Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. I've always used a tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find where he went. I can't believe my papa might still be alive. I've missed him so much. I need a weapon for the Zerks, right? My papa definitely took one with him. We just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slum should be able to help. Come with me. I'll open the door for you. Gee, thanks, dude. Run along, kitty. Kitty, run along. We trash this place. Just clean up once in a while, my dude. That's a cigarette boxes. You don't even smoke, you're a robot. Okay. Heading back to Momo. At this place. Hey. Who are you? Those guys better not drop paint bucket again. Or else Kashima will be ticked off. As we go back to the bar guys, I think this is where we're gonna end this episode. We made it all the way to the tower, we fixed the transceiver, we figured out that Seamus' dad Doc is missing and now we've got more or less a way to track him. I think that is a good place to end this episode. Anyway guys, if you like my videos, please leave a like and subscribe and leave a comment if there's anything else you would like to see me play. Thanks guys. Cheers.